Hello, my name is Nigel Semmets and I'm the Contingency Planning Officer for the Animal and Plant Health Agency's National Bee Unit. Today I'm going to talk to you about the Asian Hornet, why it's important, what it looks like and how you can help us by reporting suspect sightings. The Asian Hornet first arrived in France from China over 10 years ago and has since spread throughout France and into adjacent countries. It's thought to have got to France within the shipment of pots. Asian hornets have a similar lifestyle to social wasps and only mated queens can overwinter. Usually this is in a crevice somewhere like bark or leaf litter, but it could be in man-made objects like pots or buildings. The queens emerge in February to March to start a colony and in the autumn the colony produces drones and queens, with around 200 queens per colony. These mate and disperse over winter. The parent colony dies off during the winter. Asian hornets eat a variety of insects, but most of the diet is honeybees, and in southwest France this has led to significant honeybee colony losses during the winter. That's why it's so important that we take rapid action to identify and destroy any nests. A number of our native insects are commonly mistaken for the Asian hornet. These include the European hornet, which is actually larger than the Asian hornet. This useful guide, produced by the non-native species secretariat, shows the common features of the Asian hornet, as well as uh, the other insects that can be mistaken for it. The key features of the Asian hornet are its yellow legs, the black thorax, and a single yellow band on the abdomen. It's important to note that the Asian hornet poses no greater risk to humans than other bees. The first Asian hornet outbreak was identified in England in 2016. A beekeeper spotted a single Asian hornet displaying characteristic hawking behaviour in front of one of his hives in Tetbury. A local bee inspector from the National Bee Unit saw several more hornets when she visited and our well-established protocol to eradicate them was immediately triggered. Local beekeepers and householders were very helpful in promptly reporting sightings and suspect nests. A team of bee inspectors visited all apries and possible foraging sites in the area and put up special monitoring traps. Our inspectors tracked hornets which were carrying honeybees back to their nest to feed their young and used this tracking to information to triangulate a small area. The nest was found within this area at the top of a 50 foot tree and it was swiftly destroyed. Since then there have been no more findings of Asian hornet in that area. However, we can't afford to be complacent and we remain vigilant across the country. People can help us by looking out for Asian hornets in the nests over the summer and reporting any sightings using the new Asian Hornet app. If a nest is found, please take care not to disturb it, but do report it so that it can be safely removed. More information on Asian hornets is available on the Non-Native Species Secretariat website and the National Bee Unit's website, Bee Base. Suspect sightings can also be reported via the non-native species website by emailing alert non-native or by ringing the National Bee Unit office. Thank you for watching.